Sunday's probables, it's going to be Jordan Montgomery riding, as I mentioned earlier, a scoreless inning streak of 14 and two-thirds innings. And once again, the Marlins sending Theodore Boagod Davis to the mound. They have not picked a starter, but they will. Their starter today, actually, was a pretty good starter that they settled on in Trevor Rogers. In the meantime, Yankees got to him a little bit. They outlasted him, as you said on the pregame. Listen, they're going to try and do the same to the Marlins pitcher on Sunday, but it's Montgomery that's got to keep throwing up zeros. Part of that scoreless streak that you referenced is his last start, five innings against the Tampa Bay Rays. He threw a lot of pitches. He ended up throwing 102 pitches, but he really did a solid job of slowing down that offense. Cruz was new to the Rays lineup at that point, and you wondered about that matchup for Montgomery. He handled him very well. He got a strikeout. He got a big double play in that game. But, Bob, I think we've talked about the Yankees' inability to sweep this season. This is a series they have to sweep. The Marlins are not a very good team this year. Yes, the Marlins have some good pitchers, but they're a team that's 15, 16 games under 500. The Yankees do not want to be leaving that stadium tomorrow having left the game out there. They need a solid performance for Montgomery, and they need their lineup to continue to produce. They've scored seven runs in two games, but it's been enough because the Marlins don't have a lot of offense.